Alright, and this time, it's our seventh fight of the night on your fight card. This is Advanced Amateur MMA, scheduled for three three-minute rounds. Introducing at this time, fighting out of the red corner. 21 years old, at a height of 5'7", a weight of 133 pounds, with a record of four wins, just one loss. From Loganville, Georgia. Fighting for ATT Gwinnett, red corner, Aaron Quaid. His opponent, fighting out of the blue corner, 24 years old, 5'7", a weight of 134 pounds, with a record of 2-2, two two. from Kennesaw, Georgia. Fighting for Striker Fight Center, blue corner, Victor Wilker. Welcome to round number one. Again, three three-minute rounds. Your referee, Mr. Blake Grice. I'm excited for this one. These guys are staring each other down. Man. Oh, yeah. You got to love that. Yeah, I've seen Victor fight a few times, man. He's, he's, oh, yeah. He's a slinger on the feet. Going against Aaron Quaid, 4-1. and one. His only loss is to Rusty Crowder by a, kind of a crazy submission. Rusty's fighting in the co-main event tonight against Travis Knight. That should be a good one. Oh, yeah. And, of course, they got the beard himself, Blake Grice. The best beard in the business. Getting things underway here in round number one of our first advanced amateur fight of the night. Punches to the face on the ground. All right, go. And, and here we go. Swinging right away. And Aaron now with the knees. Victor with a nice leg kick there. Nice one-two. Man, these guys are slinging. Nice little short uppercuts there in the clinch there by Wilker. Yeah, Wilker's got Quaid here against the fence. Quaid's coming out of ATT Gwinnett down there with the Lima brothers and Amir Dadovic. Pretty solid camp. And you know those guys have him ready. Oh, yeah. Victor's now looking for a single. And he and gets, he gets it. it. Wow. Wow, talk about fast-paced action here, Jesse. Yeah, you got to love the 135ers. That's my weight class. You wouldn't believe it right now looking at me. But <laughs> that's actually my weight class. Wow. Yeah, I had to take a second look there. I'm like, really? Yeah. 135? Hard left knee lands by Victor. It seems like Will Kurt is anticipating Quaid coming in. Yeah. I would think that Quaid was going to shoot for a takedown in this fight. It's normally what I've seen him do before. Oh, what happened here? Looks like we might have got a little bit of a low blow. Oh, my. Looks like Wilkert's got a little bit of a cut over there on his left eye. Can't really see it from here, Jesse. Maybe you can. Definitely look like he's, he's cut up there. Oh, yeah, right above the right eye there. Inside leg kick lands by Victor. And again with the leg kick is Wilkert. Wilkert now looking to find a home for that hook. Yeah, you know, I love the combinations he's throwing here. Quay with a nice leg kick and now clinches up with him. Looking for that Muay Thai plum. And again, drops levels going for that high crotch single. And he gets it. And now Quaid is inside control. Victor and Wilker, gets it. wow, what a reversal there. He's got his back, looking to get both of those hooks in. Yeah, he definitely needs to try and get his hooks in here. Looks like he's got over under. Oh, my. Ten seconds left here in the first round. Wow, what a display of grappling here by Wilkirk, who's primarily a striker. What a back and forth round. You know, I definitely have to give that first round to Victor, though. 
that was kind of a surprise there. I, I didn't expect to see the jiu-jitsu of Wilkert come out in this fight, but that's why it's mixed martial arts. Yeah, definitely. All right. And here we go, round number two underway, and they're coming out swinging again. Just as they did in round one. I think Wilkert's corner was telling him, try and keep this fight on the feet, which is where he's most comfortable. Inside leg kick lands. And it seems like Quaid is looking to come a lot more forward in this fight. Look at Wilkirk with the head movement. Look at this, Jesse. Man, I like his style. And Wilkirk is fired up. Look at this. This is a guy I'm going to have to look out for on the, when he makes his pro run. No doubt about that. And Quaid is, is looking kind of surprised. I don't think he expected for Wilkirk to come out this aggressive. But Wilkert is bringing it to him with another leg kick and another. Big overhand just misses, and he's shooting for a takedown now. Up against the cage again they go. Nice use of the wizard here by Quaid. That old wizard always comes in handy, huh, partner? Yeah. He's got pretty good head position here, too. Looking to drag him down. He needs to get there. Ah, just what I was about to say. He tried, but... He's still got that body clinch on, but it looks like Quaid is about to pass him the full mount. No, he's in half guard now. Yeah. Quaid's got a wrestling background, so he's going to be pretty strong here on top. Let's see if Victor can get off his back here. He was able to land a good reversal in the first round. And it looks like Wilcott's going to escape here with this sweep. And he gets back to his feet, but is met with a knee to the face. And Wilcott now with the plum. Oh, hard body shot. And look at Victor Wilcott now. Victor. Look at this, ladies and gentlemen. Teeing off they again. They are swinging it out here. Man, big punches by Victor Wilkert. Nice overhand left. And Quaid is still maintaining control of that Muay Thai clinch. Reverses Wilkert up against the cage now, throwing some knees. Man, what a back and forth fight. Wow. <laughs> big heart by Victor, though, man. Slinging punches every chance he gets. He's definitely trying to finish this fight. No doubt about that. And now Victor's got Aaron against the fence. And now he's throwing punches again. Body shots landing, knees. Man, what a fight. My, my, my. Hard inside leg kick by Victor. Oh, wow. wow what an explosive round that was. The fans definitely got their, their money's worth on that one there. Oh, yeah. Wow, Victor Wilker showing his stuff here. All right, here we go, round number three. Let's see if Victor can hold up that pace he was holding the first two rounds. He's looking a little tired right now. And Aaron definitely needs to be more aggressive in this round and definitely needs to come forward and put some pressure on Victor or Victor's just going to come out and just try to find a home for one of those knuckleball-like hooks that he was throwing. Yeah. Inside leg kick checked by Aaron. Yeah, Victor's definitely slowed down a little bit this round. Takes a lot of energy to man maintain a pace such as he did. Yeah. Quaid measuring Will Curtin now. Nice body kick there by Quaid. Ooh, oh, my. Big right hand lands by Victor. Victor is just throwing caution to the wind here. In round three, going for it all. Big punch of the land of Aaron now. And now Quaid's starting to come on strong. Missed there with that kick. And now Quaid's starting to land. Quaid now making a little bit of a comeback, but will it be enough? 
And it seems like the ground is just canceled out here in round three, Jesse. They said we're just going to stand up and trade. Yeah, I like it. Can't complain. Not at all. And again, they go back to the clinch here. Victor's got double underhooks here against the fence right in front of his corner. Quaid's corner calling for the knees. And look at this now with the short uppercuts. Look at Aaron Quaid now. Will Curtis spent here, Jesse, but he's still giving it his all. And you can hear the crowd chanting, let's go Quaid, let's go Quaid. What happened there, Jesse? I don't know what Blake is yeah, telling It looked him. like a low blow, but Victor was saying he didn't do it. Oh, wow. And oh, wow! Looks like that little oh. fire by the Wilker. And drags him down to the ground, does Quaid. Now Quaid is in. Now Wilker looking for an arm bar, looks like here, Jesse. Wow, he might have it too if he can just get his left leg across. But Quaid is still doing damage. Oh no. Yeah, looks like Quaid's out of it. But he's still fishing for it. Wow. And now back to full guard. Need to make one last push here, does Will Kurt. Wow. What an exciting end to round three. Man, I have no idea who's going to win this Man, fight. That is definitely a tough one. Both guys were you know, definitely that, going for it all day. Our referee, Blake Rice, bringing both fighters into the center ring. Advanced amateur MMA scheduled for three three-minute rounds, and it went the distance. These guys were slamming. Give them a round of applause. Decision here tonight at Wild Bills. 